Hi there, Ian Dixon here. How are you today? Uh, today's business tip is actually has come as a response uh, of a coaching meeting that I had. It, it was just something that got discussed and it's to do with your marketing. So if you are a business owner and you are into marketing and uh, it's of interest to you, then stick around because this will be a very short uh, concise and straightforward business tip around marketing. So uh, please do click on our subscribe button and ding the bell, uh, but let's get into it. So uh, basically the conversation was around the quality of the marketing printed material that was about to be sent out. And um, uh, the the, the, something that goes around my head every single time I look at anybody's marketing material, especially if I'm like at networking events and things, I, I, I'll always look at uh, other business owners' marketing assets, if you like. And the the line that I use is that, which is something that is absolutely worth writing down. So uh, the line that I use is that everything that it was that is outward facing should reflect its potential return. So when it comes to marketing, everything that is outward facing should reflect its potential return. So a real life example is that if I was somebody that cleaned windows of uh, houses and conservatories, for example, um, it would be okay for me to advertise and market that business with a black and white uh, photocopied uh, flyer or leaflet to put through letterboxes. If I was somebody that sold conservatories and double glazing, it would not be okay for me to advertise and promote my products and services on an 80 gram black and white printed leaflet because everything that is outward facing should reflect its potential return. And um, making sure, that, and that goes right across the board on everything that you have as a business. So I've got a business at the moment that I work with and she has increased her average order value. It's more than doubled. So it was 480 quid, I think 480 pounds average order value. And over the course of 2019, um, she got that average order value to over a thousand pounds. And into 2021, because they take pre-orders for future bookings, I know that that's now even higher than that. It's 1,350 pounds, I think. So now a lot of the success of that average order value has happened as a result of the quality of what is outward facing, in as much that the, um, uh, the quality of the marketing material, the website, the um, the case studies, the photography, the choice of photography, they all have been geared towards a higher end market customer. So, so that's pretty much it. The, 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 the marketing tip today is stop and check and make sure that everything that you have that is outward facing, every, every element of it, all, all of your print online, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, everything that you have outward facing, just check and make sure that it portrays and delivers um, and represents the potential return that you could have back. So, because if you're somebody, for example, that um, is gonna do a leaflet drop, for example, and um, you have a middle to high end product that is um, that has a, a high return, um, but you want to do a hundred thousand leaflet drop, for example, um, and so you can't afford to go heavy on on the print. Is to uh, my advice would be to actually reduce down the circulation and make sure that what you do send out is representative of what it is that you're selling. So, so that was it. A five minute tip today on marketing. And the core message is everything that is outward facing should reflect its potential return. And if it doesn't, you need to either remove it or alter it and adjust it in, in, in such a way that it is reflective of what you could potentially get back. Hope you found it useful. 
please press the subscribe and ding the bell and we have plenty more videos coming for you in 2020 uh, at least 300 uh, we're gonna keep badgering away one a day there'll be something in here that's useful or of value to you so please do uh, join us on the channel and we look forward to catching up with you next time bye for now